first group takeoff. Oh. What's oh up? My God. Whoa, everyone chill. <laughs> A legend was made, made. What's going on everyone? This past weekend was an extremely crazy weekend. Turn it off. It cut, take the battery off. I love right the snow the on the drone. Toyota Highlander. We'll like wave or yell or something. Look at two scenarios. Where's Charlie? He's about to take a nap. Well, no, he is not. Where is he? So four months ago, James and I started a company called Iconic ED. Just think about it. You probably know at least one person who owns or has flown a drone before. And yeah, I know, this is my last semester. I'm supposed to be graduating. I'm supposed to focus on my classes, get out of school. I hear enough of that from my advisor. So over the weekend, we finished our first real iteration of our product. And this took massive help from our third teammate. And I hope you know who she is by now. But if you don't, she's an assassin. The US, China, India, and the UAE all have regions that are already using cloud seeding. Maybe one day we will see cloud seeding expanding as a solution to control storms, reduce hail, and quench fires. I, I walk in and Kyle's like, as you're speaking, he's like saying a word for word with you. <laughs> he's it in. Twist it right. and connect it. So what problem is Iconic EDU trying to solve? Well, we're in the year 2019 right now, which sounds pretty futuristic actually. <laughs> think, think about it, we're supposed to have like flying cars and things in 2020 or something, but uh, anyway, there are less and less kids in high school who become interested in STEM and follow that all the way through college to get a degree. But as I just said, we're heading towards the future and we're supposed to be growing 13% in job demand for STEM based jobs by a certain year, 20, 25, 20, 27, something like that. So what that's saying is that even though jobs are growing throughout the US for STEM based jobs, the people who are interested are declining, which means we need something to catalyze these students' minds in high school and to get them or earlier to think about, wow, like, is this something I would be interested in? Getting them interested in math and sciences and engineering, um, all these sorts of things, right? And we hope that our products can get kids excited about STEM in this way. One thing we're really trying to incorporate with our products and kits are interactive videos, videos that are kind of YouTube style, right? And it'd be silly for me to sit here and not think that part of the influence of that wasn't from sitting here on this channel, like talking to you guys, right? Part of that was definitely influenced by that, thinking like, wow, this is a pretty good method for getting people to see like how things work and why they're important. Um, but the only thing is that we need them to be better quality videos, right? Can't it just be me sitting here stitching things together like I normally do. This is where um, one of our good friends, Rob, came in. Big shout out to Rob for coming through and helping us, pretty much doing the whole production for this, making, turning this garage into a Hollywood style studio. Is there any other like subtle details that kids would be doing like when they're setting this up? So like you have the kit, we have lighting, like is there anything else? So it's like if you're setting the scene, like you're putting on gloves. For them, for them, yeah, like yeah, for what so they're like, doing. Hey Alexa, play Middle Child by J. Cole. Bro, why are you having Alexa? Huh? I'm just kidding. Our title. I don't know. It works with Apple Music. It used to not work with Apple Music, but now they do. I just don't know if they update. Oh, that's right. You switched. You were on Spotify. No, I was always on Apple Music. <laughs> Cards is like, that's right. <laughs> yeah, get that plastic one. <laughs> did I just pull them? Yep. Yeah. You might have to hold it, like, put, like, like kind of hand on the left side just yeah. to keep it down. But... Logistically, this was a very interesting weekend. We had already canceled this whole thing uh, a few weekends before because of the snow. But Lenore flew in on a Friday evening, flew out on a Sunday evening. So chaos, this was pretty much chaos in that in-between period. So by the end of the second day, everyone was lack of sleep, feeling a little like uh, shaky. And uh, I think a little bit of sickness was coming into play. I feel like I might be getting sick and you guys are just gonna send me back to Houston. <laughs> like, at least she made it through the weekend. <laughs> 
Isn't it like you practice for a thousand, ten thousand hours? It's just more practice. Toggle, I think, yeah. Mid game pick me up, my guy. Mid game pick me up. We gotta keep, we gotta keep it going. We're almost there. Mid game pick me up. Mid game pick me up. Is he already napping? <laughs> Charlie, where's Charlie? He's about to take a nap. Well, no, he is not. Where is he? <laughs> Where are you at, bro? Mid game, pick me up, bro. We need to read a fist pound <laughs> just to keep going, bro. Almost done, right? We're almost there. All in all, I couldn't imagine this actually coming out any better. It was uh, it's pretty crazy about how many potential failures there could have been there, or real mess ups there could have been, but uh, I think it all went well. And I don't think there was a better way to end it than to see uh, Charlie and Lenora flying drones for their first time. First group takeoff. Ready? Oh. Oh my God. Whoa, everyone chill. Oh my God. <laughs> wait, wait, where is it? Okay. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Let's see, dude. It's like, oh no, it's still going. Guys. Can we go to the. Oh, oh my god, look up! Oh my god! Let it come down! Just let it come down! Let it come down! Oh man, I was nervous there, bro. I thought every day I was gonna have to come out and look at one of our drones on that roof. That's what I thought was gonna happen. As I said before guys, this accidental engineer series, I'm not sure exactly sure which way to take it. I'm not sure what you want to see. It's hard for me to um, completely seal these off and make them complete videos because everything that I'm doing in life right now is like still open and running, right? I'm not like finishing projects right now. They're just all gonna be running through the semester. So be sure to let me know what you want to see, whether it's like classroom stuff, this type of project stuff, business stuff, whatever. Let me know and uh, I'll be sure to get that to you guys. Be sure to like and subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. It's rubber, I'm gonna burn this gasoline and set it on fire, 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 fire. Hope someone sees it,